Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel. And this is a uh, little update on something that I uh, didn't think I had to eventually talk about again. So at the beginning of the year, everybody knows that uh, Adobe Flash was officially um, you know, out of support. It was ended by Adobe. And Microsoft eventually issued an optional update that removes whatever Flash player was left. So those of you that went to the control panel, you could see that there was something there left <coughs> called Flash player. And even though you didn't have officially a Flash player installed, there was a Flash player within Windows that was in the control panel. So a lot of you, including me, had that optional update that removed the Flash player here. But some of you have decided to make sure that that update doesn't install and block it. And what happens is that you will still have a Flash player pre-installed within Windows because of that. Uh, doing so is not a good idea because no more support means that Flash player is getting more and more security flaws probably that can be exploited. Um, Microsoft has issued today another uh, notice to say that, uh, well, if you haven't had that update, when you will have Patch Tuesday of uh, June or July of this year, what's going to happen is that uh, you will actually have this forced removed and Flash Player will be gone and there will be absolutely no way to reinstall a version of it. Not only will it be gone from the PC, but Windows will make sure that if you would go and get an old version, for example, to try to install, it's going to be blocked from installing on the computer. So whatever you do starting July of 2021, there won't be a possibility to have anything Flash installed on the computer. So this is something that is official. And uh, of course, it's mainly to keep everybody safe because the problem isn't that they don't like Flash because if it wasn't for a security reason, if it wasn't that there's a risk, they wouldn't care if it's there. It's really because Flash Player will become a huge risk if you keep it and especially because it's running code that comes from the internet. So, you know, some guy out there, some hacker might do some bad code and infect people because of this. So in July, it's gone and impossible to come back into Flash officially. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.